What is up, my little internet land? Um, okay, so I was talking to a love Koei this morning, and, you know, I had this, like, low-effort ADHD meal when I have, like, no brain cells left, and it doesn't have to be thawed or anything. I just kind of, like, throw it together, put it in a skillet, come back, stir it a few times, and, um, it's, like, done. Yeah, super easy. So, um, anyways, I was just going to show you guys that. If that's cool. So, um, yeah, stick around if you're up to seeing it. Oh, it's been a day. What a sad, sad day. My tripod has broken. It is now a two pod. This just won't do. Okay, so we are making do, right? Anyway, um, this is the supplies. Oh, wait, forgot one. Okay, there we go. Um, did I pick Garden Rotini just because the colors? I mean, I'm not going to lie to you. Yes, yes, I did. Anyway, so I uh, just like Walmart brand and diced chicken breast. I've had this two pound bag for like an entire month and it has made so many of these like little scallop meals. Um, I got a couple of different kinds of pasta and I've also been using a bunch of different seasonings. Um, this one is from the Oddities convention that we went to last year. Um, cracked pepper and lime. It's a really fun one. Boyfriend really likes it. Anyway, uh, star fried veggies and I also cut it with a little bit of broccoli just you know add more bulk and the pasta and up next I will show you what we do on the skillet when we throw it all together <laughs> okay this is the most intense part of this whole thing um, the pan is on like super high heat and I just toss the pieces of chicken that were left in the bag in there little bit of seasoning. I'll probably add more in a bit, but um, yeah, I just, uh, you know, how you cook chicken, just kind of wait until you see that, you know, color line, and I'm probably going to flip this here in a second. Hold on. Okay, so I flipped it, rubbed it around the pan a little bit, so it got a little bit of the browning, a little bit of seasoning. I'm going to give this like another maybe minute and a half. Be right back. One of the absolutely most awesome bits about this chicken is um, it will kind of like break apart as you're cooking it. So yay! Okay, all set. We're not going to worry about the browning in the pan because I'm about to toss some water in there to delight it. Yay! Toss the veggies in. Take it down to medium heat. Toss in the pasta and a third a cup of water. At this point, um, I would probably add a little bit more seasoning, but I do that separately when I'm making food for Boyfriend and I, because he likes his food lightly seasoned, and I'm like, oh my god, give me all the salt, yay! But anyways, just stir it around, and then um, turn the heat down to, uh, gosh, I said like one, in between one and two, and cover it, and walk away for like five minutes, Come back, stir it. I will be right back. Okay, so it's been five minutes, and you see the pasta is kind of like starting to soften up and stuff. Um, I'm just kind of like stirring it around, making sure it's all, you know, touched the water at least. And um, yeah, be back in another five minutes when this water should have like cooked off a little bit more or into the pasta or like whatever water and pasta do when they're put together i don't i don't know like science yeah it, it's science right not gonna lie to you march so it wasn't cooking fast enough i turned it up to medium heat sizzle 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 so i did go ahead and add just a teeny bit more seasoning Shh, don't tell Oh look, it's finally cooking away. All gone. Um, okay, so if you like it a little bit more saucy, just toss some butter in there right now. Um, we kind of like it a little bit dry in this house, and like I said, I'll add more seasoning and buttering some butter to my individual serving. But really, it's just a super easy meal, and it, it looks like you spent way more than two and a half minutes prepping it, and you know, like fifteen minutes cooking it.
Yay. Peace out, my lovelies.